Now if you're getting weird funky algae in your aquarium, it usually means that there's something funky going on with your water quality. So it's quite common that you'll have an environment even where the corals might be going quite well, but you're getting strange algae. And a lot of the time the strange algae is just due to irregularities in your water quality. Something else to look at too is things like your phosphate removers. If you're using phosphate remover liquids, and you're not using polyfilter to remove residual phosphate remover liquid and if you are dosing phosphate removers and you do not have phosphate in the aquarium you'll have all sorts of nutrient problems also if you're dosing any nitrate removers and if you do not have a good skimmer and it's not cleaned twice a week and if you do not have nitrate in the aquarium you'll have all sorts of problems as a result of the nitrate remover so do not put nitrate remover liquid nitrate removers or liquid phosphate removers in the aquarium if you do not have nitrate or phosphate otherwise you'll end up with problems so um, getting a better understanding of your test results is really the key to ensuring that you're getting the good coralline algae. if you're getting the good coralline algae, it means that you're winning and um, if you're getting these weird funky algae, it just means that there's something wrong so quite often you may just have to get a more accurate test so maybe the tests that you're doing are inadequate so get maybe like a JBL test lab or do some ICP tests or get more accurate tests to find out what's out of whack and then correct what's in whack and then it will take time and you'll eventually fix it